after the hurricane. And we're supposed to evacuate today by one o'clock because this is a state park, so they force everyone to evacuate even though the hurricane's not gonna be here until uh, Tuesday or Wednesday, today's Saturday. So we got here last night and now we have to leave today. It sucks. Good job, buddy. before the storm, <laughs> literally. Keller says it's fun finding shark teeth, but I wouldn't know. I've literally been looking, I've literally been looking the whole time we've been out here and I have found zero. How many have you found, Keller? Three. Little brat. I haven't been looking the whole time. I was swimming half. Like I said, brat. that it might not quite work out. But we were hoping for the best. So they come to the campsite and they get here a little bit before I do. I arrived at the campsite at 10 p.m. last night with Tennyson. And then... In Florida, Georgia, and South Carolina have declared states of emergency ahead of the storm. Hurricane Dorian now a Category 2 storm strengthening this morning, threatening to hit Florida as a major Category 4 hurricane. Yeah, let's take a look at So basically the second that I pull up, I was told that, that we could all stay the night, but we would have to be leaving tomorrow by 1 p.m. the very next day. Like, imagine my parents. Like, they've already set up the camper, hooked it up, everything ready to go. I've packed me in Tennyson and all that good stuff. Oh baby, the sand hurts. Come here, sweet girl. 
Um, we are here now, and it looks like the hurricane is going to hit our house. So Chad is going to be there. Our house should be safe. It's not even going to be as bad as um, the last really bad hurricane we had was Irma two years ago, whenever I got pregnant with Tennyson. <laughs> so Chad's going to be there. He has the kitties with him. I have Gracie with me. And we're going to be staying with my parents a little bit north. And um, yeah, that's what we're doing. I wasn't prepared to go straight from here to my parents' house, but that's what Chad said he would prefer that we do. And I think it's really just a good excuse for him to like walk around naked and watch as many games as he wants and play as much Xbox as he wants. Do all the stupid things that I don't like while we're gone. So anyway, we were planning on not camping in our RV. And if you saw Miss D's latest video, then you understand what I'm saying. Camping, I don't understand why people do it. I really don't. But if you're a camper, like a real camper, where you go and you pitch a tent and you live off the land and you're not in an RV or a camper trailer or something like that, like that, I don't consider camping. That's not camping. It's camping, but it's not camping. You're When you're living off the land, that's when you're camping. I still love you, Dee. I still love you, even though you made fun of us in our RV. <laughs> that we're not camping. <laughs> I agree with you though. It's not camping. It's like luxurious camping. <laughs> we have toilets. Um, that's what we were planning on doing was not camping in our RV, but we were here for not even 24 hours before we had to leave and that's the way it works sometimes. So we just don't know whether or not Dorian is going to hit our house. It looks like it is. And so we'll be leaving here pretty soon to go north. As a young girl the fields were mine We played hide and seek for hours Raised our shadows among the pines So offshore playful and free Without a care in the world I was one rich little girl what are you doing sitting on the table? Papa let you sit on the table. Take me back all the way back to the day. Running around. Yeah, yeah. Gown and a crown. Barefoot. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> no mistake ever kept me late We spent summers catching fireflies And winters on our skates One big smile across my face We used to dance our way to church on Sundays Mama set the pace Daydreamer, kidnapped 